iGathering Church. It's so great to connect with you from Africa, Mozambique specifically. I just want to thank you, the leadership, uh, Pastor Stephen, uh, the whole Gathering Church, just for helping us in an amazing way. You can never imagine what the Gathering Church has done the last two, three years with us in Mozambique and specifically in other African countries. Maybe you know it or maybe not, but uh, the Gathering Church has helped us to spread and distribute uh, a few hundred Bibles the last two to three years. And I want to sincerely thank you this morning and tell you just a little bit of what God has done uh, in a minute or two. Uh, one of the things I've experienced a few weeks ago as I uh, just distributed a few Bibles that your church has helped us with, and I went into an area, it was a long drive, it was a difficult drive. I got in there, and to my amazement, as I grew and, and went closer to the village where, where we got to, it was amazing to see pastors for about 50 meters on their knees crawling towards my vehicle to receive their first Bible. And they were amazed. And, and I wish I could sense to, uh, just and tell you uh, what has happened there. I was just truly humbled. And thank you for being part of that. One of the other things we've done in Tanzania, we've planted some churches uh, in Dar es Salaam specifically, where the population is about 99% Muslim. And uh, as we got to this place and we planted a few churches, told, uh, told them about the real Jesus, opened the word of God with them, and showed them that Jesus Jesus was not just a prophet. He truly was the son of God. We opened the Bible. We started a church. And to my amazement, a few Muslims came in and said, listen, this is the Jesus we want to know. And it was through the word of God that we could actually do that. Thank you for being part of that. You know, one of the things that I've experienced is that we do get weary and tired spreading the gospel. And even some people have told me, listen, it's the 21st century. We don't need the Bible anymore. And I want to tell you that is a lie. Uh, the countries we move, we move in, in Eastern Africa, all over Africa, we realize there's a shortage of Bibles. And I want to read to you a scripture that I got this morning from the Lord in Jeremiah 20. And that's in verse 9. Just, just listen to this and what the Lord says. And it, it really burns in my heart. It says in verse 9, If I say I will not make mention of the Lord or speak any more in His name, in my mind and heart, it is as if there were a burning fire shut up in my bones and I'm weary of enduring and holding it in. I cannot contain it any longer. And may you share this passion with us as you've had, you have as a church to truly go out and, and endure and share the gospel and also for sharing the word of God as you've done. So Gathering Church, I hope you will join me soon enough to also help me to distribute Bibles and come with me and see what God is doing. But specifically, Pastor Stephen, the Gathering Church leadership, and you as a member of the church. Thank you. We really love you, and thank you so much for caring.